Japanese shareholders of a holding firm for Korea's fifth largest conglomerate, Lotte Group, have voted in favor of keeping Lotte Group chief in his current job. That a day after Shin Dong bin made a public apology and promised reform measures to improve the group's opaque governance structure. Kim Jung Soo has the details. The chairman of Lotte Group, Shin Dong bin, will continue his position to lead the scandal hit retail giant. After shareholders voted in his favor on Wednesday, the latest development in a lengthy and bitter public feud between Shin and his older brother for the control of Korea's fifth largest family run conglomerate. During Wednesday's three hour shareholders' meeting at the group's headquarters in Tokyo, shareholders passed a majority vote to keep the incumbent chief in his current role. The meeting was attended by Shin himself, who the day before made a public apology. And promised reform measures to restore the retail giant's brand image, which has been dented by a corruption investigation. Last week, Korean prosecutors indicted the 61 year old tycoon without physical detention on charges of orchestrating a series of shady deals at the group's affiliates, as well as giving large stipends to the owner's family, who are just being listed as board members of the conglomerate's Korean and Japanese branches. Lotte Holdings serves as a de facto holding firm for major Lotte subsidiaries in Japan and Korea. It also holds a 19% stake in Hotel Lotte, a hidden jewel that seeks to list its shares on the Seoul boards. The Seoul based group, founded in Tokyo in 1948, has a vast network of businesses in Korea and Japan, including department stores, hotels, and processed food. With combined assets valued at more than 90 billion U.S. dollars, Kim Jong-soo, Arirang News.